Welcome to FIFA 22, but every player starts at their full potential. What did he say? Hey. Yes, this is going to be fun. I'm sure you've been waiting for this video. We're finally doing it in FIFA 22. I've literally done this in every FIFA, and I've yet to do it this year, so it's happening. Okay, here's what is going to happen. We are going to go into team sheets. We're going to be looking at which teams are now the best in the world. Which club will be the new dominant one in the Premier League? Which international team will win the World Cup now with these upgrades? You are going to find out, but only if you hit the like button right now. You hit the like button. You get to keep watching, so I'll sit here and wait. Hit the like button. Have you done it? Okay, you have. Good, let's go. Okay. Team sheets. We click and we get to see Arsenal. Screw it, they're the first club. Martinelli now at an 87 overall. Their new signing, Ben White, 86 for him. And Odegaard and Saka now become the two highest rated players in Arsenal. Will it be enough for Arsenal to win the league? Hmm. Probably not. So we won't go through every team, but even a team like Villa now is going to be really, really good with Watkins up to an 83, Ramsey 84, Mings, Bailey at an 86 overall. I actually think Villa could be like maybe like a top eight team. So a club like Chelsea is probably going to be towards the top of the prem with Mount maxing out, Werner maxing out. Uh, Pulisic's going to be down there on the bench. Christian Pulisic at an 88. Let's go. Basically, what we're doing to start is scouting out the best teams in the world to choose the one that we are going to take into a career mode. And then once we're into the career mode, we're going to be able to make signings with our transfer budget. All right, we need to search this up. Is there a new highest rated player in FIFA 22? All right, the newest top rated player plays for PSG. It's, it's Kylian Mbappe. Player... Number four is Jan Oblak. Jan Oblak. Wow. I didn't realize he had 95 potential. Erling Holland. And then the last but not least, Donnarumma. Wow. I mean, PSG have somehow got even better. I feel like we should make a rule right now. I shouldn't be able to use PSG. They're just too good. New objective in today's video, destroy PSG at all costs. Right. Barca struggling in real life. Let's see how they're going to be. Because they got some young talent. Best player on Barca. Boom, Frankie De Jong. Player two, Ter Stegen. He even goes up. Pedri. Guys, uh, low-key, I might take over Barcelona and just try to make them great again. This is what they could be, boys. Fati 90 overall. They got Dest playing on the right wing position. If I were to be the manager, which I may be, I'd probably play Dembele. But let's be honest. This is probably now one of the best teams in the game. And look at the bench, bro. It's even better down here. Boys, I'm liking Barca. Real good. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't know why I just made that weird. My bad. All right, which other club do we want to explore here? You know who I feel? Well, <sighs> City. City's just one of those, dude. It's just going to be unfair. Like KDB 93, Ederson 93, Foden 92, Foden to Beast, Diaz 92, Rodri 90. How many 90 rated players does this team have? Oh my God. Literally seven, seven 90 rated players. And they're starting 11. In my opinion, we just, we can't start with Man City. Anyone else agree that Man City would just be boring to start with? I don't know. A lot of good players. <sighs> I just, I, I don't think I could bring myself to choose them. We'll see though. You never know. All right. Um, Manchester United. Let's not hide the rest from you guys. Manchester United looking decent. Very, very decent. All the smaller clubs in the Prem. Um, everyone, everyone looks all right. Everyone's going to have some good players now. Everyone should have at least, I would say, an 84, 85 rated player. I don't think I'm really interested though in using a Prem club, if I'm going to be honest. So these will... I guess they... Wait. Holland, Donnarumma... Oh, yeah. I don't think so. FIFA has the most up-to-date potentials for some reason. Here's the thing, too. The players who, like, don't grow, like, Kane can't grow, but his potential's still at 90, so he stays at 90. Should be pretty obvious. Also, don't mind my other tab. I was trying to find... I googled crazy squirrels. That's why our friend is right here. Who we're using to unveil everything squirrels low-key might be my favorite animal i don't know why Aww. guys look how good the french national team is if they don't win the world cup i'm gonna be shocked like their team is too good i didn't want to test Kylian mbappe just to see how good he really is and he's coming up against the best keeper in the game i mean Kylian mbappe oh oblock's crazy too like Kylian mbappe bro he's just gonna end up being too good i don't know this is kind of making me want to choose atletico madrid though because oblock looks like he's literally going to be saving almost everything except that i've been using the practice arena in so many videos i love the practice arena right, i'm sorry i just need to bang a free kick with mbappe if he makes this i'm choose i can't choose psg but oh he actually made it here's every player above 85 rated i guess i can't really show you 
all of these because there's just there's just way too many but look at what has happened here boys i mean this is mad this is genuinely mad how many like 90 how many 90 plus rated that players there are let alone everyone else who's going to be extremely high rated in this game now i don't even know i don't know if career mode is going to be able to handle all of this let's go it's time to jump into the career mode i have one mission two missions two goals today i guess actually three goals goal one take sir nuts to glory goal two i guess is part of goal one take barca to glory and then goal three destroy psg financial takeover it's being covered by my face and i'm gonna give us an extra 200 million to spend let's go boys let's get into this if you've made it this far in the video guys we are about to hit 800k subscribers so be a part of the first 800k to join this channel and subscribe if you watch you may have already hit 800k so be a part of the first million and subscribe then some of you may be watching if we've hit a million so be a part of the first 1 billion subscribers and subscribe. Let's go. Let's get into this. Okay, you guys already know what the Barca team looks like, but we need to arrange the perfect starting 11. Here's the thing about this team. We're going to need a striker. Bad. I'm just throwing all of the best players in. Is this actually it? Wait, is this the best possible starting 11? I think it is. All right, we need to get rid of the pie. We need to get a striker. We need to get a CDM. That's what we need here, boys. And we're going to have a little bit of an advantage in this career mode because everyone is maxed out. Like, no one else should be able to grow except for our team because we have development plans. And if we equip development plans, players have the chance to grow past their potential. So yes, look, I'm just going through everyone and you guys can see how pretty much no one on this team no one should have growth at all, but we will be able to if we equip training styles, hopefully. So we need a striker and we have options and we're going to search via potential. Okay, here we go. These are the top options that we... Ooh, do I want to go? I think I do. Let's take a step back with the 200 million added on. It adds up to 311 million assigned players with. All right, man, 16 years old, but now with this mod, he's 89 overall. The name Yusofa Mukoko. <laughs> I've said that probably so wrong. He's only going to cost. Did that say only 90 million? I'm going to be actually shocked. If 90 million. If actually agreed. Yeah, I guess they don't need him when they already have a Holland, right? So since he was so cheap and with all of our money, we should be able to bring in at least three like big superstar players. That'll be the goal. 89 overall striker. Okay. And since we switched this formation, we actually don't need a CDM. What do we want to do here? I'm thinking a big center back. Let's just take this position by position. Probably the best way to go about it go kuande i'm thinking kuande actually dude there's a lot of solid options here but also you know only 290 rated center backs potential wise this may sound dumb but i i don't want to go for like the best of the best like i like to go a little bit below because usually it's players that we don't sign as often timber from ajax i'm only gonna actually i'm gonna cap us at three players i don't want to be able to sign more than three players I am just going to pay. I have to pay for these clause. They will not let me buy them without it. Could have gone with the lit. Could have gone with Optimicano. Always say his name wrong. But yeah, bro. Like, not worth it for me, in my opinion. We always sign them in career mode. All right. So I don't know if you saw it, but uh, well, first off, Timber is in. And that is going to leave us. I want to say 117. Yep. 117 million left. He immediately becomes the highest rated center back on this team leaving us maybe a left back to sign i feel like is that a waste of a signing though bringing in a left back ah man do we steal i'm tempted to steal from psg oh he's on loan i don't know if i'm able to sign him uh it's commonly signed i know i said i didn't want to do but i love this man one of my favorite players in real life oh god why is he insanely like i can't afford him please let me sign him oh my god why is he so expensive and everyone else isn't oh that's not happening right, how about this one bro we, we gotta steal a psg player and we're gonna go for the, i don't think i'm gonna be able to sign him either what are why are all these valuations so high only on the fullbacks all right instead i just realized we don't have like a true cam right i got a feeling foden's gonna be insane mount might be more realistic we could do mount there's a lot of good options here and that's not i'm not even looking at potential now we're looking at potential words mount musiala would be sick kubo would be sick yeah foden i i don't understand why we got those other two players so cheaply all right musiala he's left mid we can convert him to cam though pretty oh i can't afford him either is there any cam that i can afford this is ridiculous please let me sign you we'll convert him if we can get him in brian gill from spurs i think it's gonna work please please it might maybe the other players are just so young i'm guessing 100 million pounds 131 okay i actually can afford that so let's do it man i'm not gonna lie bro uh, it, i know this isn't probably his real player face but brian gill 
You are ugly, man, in this game. FIFA have done you so dirty. All right, should be simple enough. I'm going to guess it's going to take like, usually left wings take like two weeks to convert to cam. Yep, I'm at it. Let's just throw everyone on a development plan. And hopefully, they're all going to grow even more. I'll be giving it our only way to stop PSG in this. All right, now position change. Uh, he might go up and overall here too. Hopefully, he does. He doesn't. All right, boys. This is your team. So we are going to check Barcelona's progress right here in all of their competitions. Then after that's done, I think we're going to become the manager for France in the World Cup. Without further ado, can our boy Sir Nuts take Barca to glory? Wait, this is this real? All of that work and we're terminated, bro. I was literally using a mod to give us a 99 manager rating and they still sacked us. <laughs> Good thing I got another mod that makes it so as soon as I get sacked, I get signed again by Barcelona. <laughs> All right. We can play this game if you guys want. But said we got sacked because there were a problem with players. So I'm guessing it was just like contracts, probably. I'm not really worried. I, I guarantee you it was contracts. Here we go. Barca second. Oh my God. Hey, I was saying at the beginning, bro, it was Jan Oblak. Man, he was killing it in the practice arena and killed it in career mode. Well, him and Joao Felix. I should have. Wow, I messed up not going Atletico Madrid. Not even putting players to the full potential can save Barca and signing three superstars, too. Uh, oh, my God. Bro, it's the same in real life. They're in Europa League. Like, this game's too realistic. What? I'm so Benfica, bro. Okay, in real life, but even players in. Oh, my God. Oh, well, at least we should be guaranteed to win Europa League, right? Yeah, I mean, if we don't, this is like W. Oh, Atletico. I was Atletico Madrid ended up in Europa League, and they didn't even win it. Leicester won it. Career mode at player with players of full potential is just dumb. But what am I meant to do, guys? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Like, how? how is this team? Oh, that, that was a release clause, too. Can someone buy the release clause of Dembele? I've already had enough with Barca. I went off ASAP. It's time to manage France for this World Cup. And let's see the team. We did not get to choose the team that was going to get called up, but this is the team that got called up. And we're going we're gonna to win the World Cup. Hey, Dembele's back on this team, which is good. Should I? Should we keep this formation? Yeah, I guess. I guess so. Why not? It's a crazy one. It's a crazy squad. Can I play Hernandez at center back? I actually can. All right. Well, there you have it. This is the best national team ever assembled it is world cup time and here's the group wow could we have gotten an easier group i don't think so do i even have to waste my time like simming through this like all right here we go new zealand w sweden okay like we're not losing we shouldn't even be conceding with this team bro three nil to be honest the score lines will probably still be like this when we're playing the big teams i wouldn't doubt it norway <laughs> we've drawn Oh, okay. I'll, I'll give it to them. They had Holland. And we've made it out of the group still with these. I've right, got Belgium, Germany, USA topping it. It's the USA goaded. I'd love to see the USA beat us. Ro Romania and Portugal beat us. I'll, I'll love to see them win. Maybe not beat us. Italy, Canada's good with Alfonso Davies now. Crazy how, like, some of these teams are just kind of dominating. I'd say our biggest competition's probably going to be England. That's England. So they'll probably end up choking. Here we go. Ireland beat Portugal. Wait, what? That is mad. U.S., Germany. All right, we got Argentina. And although we have all of our players that are high potential, I'll tell you what, Argentina, they still have Messi, and our team is so tired. Oh, what do I do here, boys? Wait, they don't have Messi. I'm taking the risk in playing the team even though they're tired. Yay! <laughs> 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 Right, um, yo, uh, boys, appreciate you watching. Watch another video right here. I'm gonna go jump out my window, and um, if you don't hear from me in the next few days, it's because, well, I'm gonna be locked in my room crying. <laughs>